What's up guys, Funky Papa here, and I am finally doing this commentary after a very long time. I've been messing up so much and now I'm really tired of it. Yeah, it's been like a week. Yes, I know, Johnny. I'm talking to Puma right now. Um, I mentioned in another commentary already that I'm... Did I? Did I mention that he's getting his laptop fixed? I don't think so. Well, he's getting his laptop fixed, if I already didn't say it. Um, in about a week or two, possibly three, depending on how good that company is, wherever you bought it from. I finished ordering the rest of my computer parts, so I will be having a lot of Team Fortress 2 gameplay. I'm sort of getting very bored with Gears of War 3, so I might do like a couple more videos for that, like occasionally. But until that, but until I get my computer fixed, or get my computer done, um, I'm only going to be doing Gears 3, and possibly just some random other crap that I just feel like playing, like Geometry or whatever. Miss Pac-Man. Yeah. Maybe even Street Fighter. I haven't played Street Fighter in a while. I really feel like playing Street Fighter right now. But I have to finish this commentary. And, um, after I die, I have very short spawn times because um, I cut that off. Because the video would have been like 9-10 minutes if I didn't. Because I die a lot. I'm bad at everything. Alright, what do I want to talk about today? I'm going to talk about religion because someone said I should. And... No, I talked about libertarian socialism. I'm Johnny. I'm going to talk about religion in more detail now. Uh, in my book, atheism is the ideal religion because it's not a religion. And religion is pretty much my imaginary friend is better than yours. Uh, wars are started over... Like, religion is based on myth, but the bloodshed is real. That's a quote I read once, and it makes me feel smart. One of my friends is like a strong atheist. I'm gonna read his what something he wrote a quote from I forget who. It says, "If he is infinitely good, what reason should we have to fear him? If he is infinitely wise, why should we have doubts concerning our future? If he knows all, why warn him of? Oh, that was my cell phone. Why warn? Why warn him of our needs and fatigue with our prayers? If he is everywhere, why erect, erect temples to him if he is just?" Why erect temples to him? If he is just, why fear? Oh crap! It was said. Hold on. Right, um, if he is just, why fear that he will punish the creature that he has filled with weakness? If he is conceivable, why occupy ourselves with him? And if he has spoken, then why is the world not convinced? By Percy B. Shelley. That was like when I read that. I like I. Like an hour or two later, I just became an atheist because I think God was real because I couldn't answer some of my questions. But then I couldn't answer some of my questions because I didn't know. So no one knows anything. Not even this quote, quote, all-knowing being that doesn't exist. How do we know that God exists? Is there someone else who told us that God walked? Well, there's Jesus that told us God exists, but I don't believe in Jesus either. I just think he was a very, very a really good con man. That's just my opinion, but, uh, see, like, couldn't matter, like, people are like, oh, yeah, well, if Jesus is, like, I've had heard this argument so many times, like, oh, yeah, if Jesus isn't, like, the son of God, how did Mary just randomly get pregnant? Um, see, if people could still use that excuse, teen girls would be running around saying, oh, yeah, I'm pregnant with the son of God, like, because, you know, I don't have a boyfriend or anything, and I use protection, so... I think that was just her excuse, because not being married and having a child, I'm pretty sure, this is just my belief, my understanding, at that time, was like frowned upon, and you'd be looked on as like, uh, you know what I mean, like an ingrate or a prostitute or a whore. So, yeah, you probably think I'm calling Mary a whore, but that's just my opinion. Again. Islam, people just don't like it, because all they think about is bombs and stuff, but... In essence, it's a really peaceful religion if you read it word for word for word from the Quran or the Quran or whatever the hell you want to call it. But people are too ignorant to understand that. They're just like, oh yeah, those are the guys that all the convenience stores blow crap up. But still, I don't believe in God. Some of its beliefs are really obscure to me. That's what I used to be. I was born into that before I converted. So I obviously need to know, obviously know some about that religion. Hinduism, I just don't believe in idol worship. Buddhism, or sorry, Buddhism. <laughs> um, to me, that's a very peaceful and like, um, wise and philosophical religion. If I picked anyone, like if I converted to any religion, I'd probably pick that. Or Wiccan, or whatever that's called, because doing magic's cool. 
but I really don't believe in any of that because I've looked up videos for Wiccanism, stuff like that. I've tried to see Wiccan spells because I don't just bash a religion without even knowing about it. You look up anything, they're like, oh yeah, this is how you do the spell. I'm not actually doing it because I can't do it. Like, I've seen hundreds of, like, not, not hundreds, but multiple videos like that. Um, what else do? Like, ag I used to be uh, agnostic because I used to say, I don't know, but now I'm just determined I know. There's no god, like, honestly. That doesn't make any sense. You know, let's read that Yo Mama there to like the mood that I got. I'm subscribed to a Yo Mama service. I get one Yo Mama text message every day at 7.48 p.m. Yo Mama's so fat, when she fell over, she rocked herself to sleep to get back up again. Yeah, the. That's kind of funny, I guess. Oh, I oh another one. Your mom is so fat. She was floating in the ocean, and Spain came for claimed her for the new world. I'm I'm not too good with history, so I really didn't understand that. One. Back on the serious topic, God is God isn't real. Let's just put it that way. I told a lot of my friends about the agnostic and stuff and atheism. Not, none of them are atheists, but some, like, one or two convert, like, became agnostic, or said they were, then went back to, to I, I hate Catholicism. Like, that's just pretty much the point of this commentary. I hate it. Not really the religion itself, but the way people act when they are Catholic. Like, it's, oh yeah, um, only vote Republican and buy Hummers, and minorities are minorities, and they're minor, they're not good. And Obama is the Antichrist. Bush took a crap on the economy, gave it to Obama, and now all the white Republicans are saying, you're the end. Like, there was a speech Obama was giving, and some one guy was chanting, Jesus is the son of God. Jesus is the son of God, and Obama was smiling at him. Then he just started pointing and chanting at Obama, you're the Antichrist. You're the Antichrist. And Obama made his face at him like he was crazy or something. But yeah. Well, there is this other the guy who's down the chain of Godfathers. He's black. He's running for... Republican and apparently he's getting one-third of the votes and my source is very correct for this because I was watching the Daily Show earlier and I feel smart talking about the news over the internet through a video slash podcast commentary type thing yeah um what I was thinking to do when Ace Law or Curse Law and Johnny and you know Ace Law's Ryan Johnny is Poom alright when me Johnny Ryan get all of our what, Ryan already has his stuff set up. He just doesn't know what to talk about in this commentary. When we get all of our stuff set up, we're probably gonna do like podcasts and talk about stuff together. Just random funny stuff. Alright, well. Eight seconds left. Six. Alright, whatever. Uh, I'm Funky Popeye and I'm signing off. Locus.